everybody and welcome back to the channel now in today's video we're going to be doing something a little different from the usual we're going to be doing some house renovation house cleaning house some stuff in the house that's what we're doing so i've got my trusty helper stan here he's gonna help not i also got pablo who's going to not help as well so as i said in the last video chelsea has moved out which means the house is now pretty much bare because so basically, I bought all the big furniture and she bought all the little stuff, the ornaments and plants and stuff to make it all look nice. Now, obviously, she took all of that because, well, she bought it, so it's hers, so she's took all that. So now the house is pretty bare. So what we'll do is we'll give you guys, like, a house tour now of what it kind of looks like. I'll just discuss and go with, through with you guys stuff I want to do, stuff that needs to change, need to replace, whatever it is. Then we need to do a top-to-bottom clean because there's lots of dust and there's lots of things that have been moved and, like, there's now, like, just clean patches of stuff where things were and then if we get the time we'll maybe go and see if we can get some stuff and then yeah I just want to give you guys more of an insight into like our lives as a whole and just more maybe you can learn about me and things like that because obviously this is a direction the channel will probably end up going because I can do more stuff like this it's more achievable you're just gonna follow me around absolutely everywhere so we'll start off in the kitchen now to be honest you're probably not going to see much different if i do have any like before photos i'll try and like overlay them somewhere so you can see i don't know how many of i didn't really take any but if i do have any i will show you so there's some stuff missing on there there's some stuff missing in that corner there's an espresso machine that's missing but well, the bread bin's gone do some extra things on there so it's looking very basic but the main difference is in like here there's Cupboards are empty. Not just my space. Here's my cupboards. Fridge, pretty empty. Freezer, pretty empty. But to be honest, that's not empty because I haven't bought anything. That's empty because that's generally all my food. So for everyone who doesn't know, see, we can learn about each other now. Well, I can, you can learn about me. This is pretty much my whole diet, all of that and what's in there because I have an eating disorder and it's something. Now the doctor said as you grow up it'll just go away and don't worry about it, you'll eventually just grow out of it. Um 27 in like three days, so maybe I've not stopped growing yet, hopefully not, because I'm still very short, but that's just by and by. Now it's a topic that isn't very interesting to me, but people find it absolutely fascinating and anybody who finds out asks like 200 questions. So maybe one day we'll discuss it further. I don't know. If you're interested, let us know. But I think we're pretty good for in here, aren't we, fella? I think the key going forward is going to be less is more, because less is cheaper. So that's good. You put that there. And then just sit that more central. That'll do. Oh, look at that. Look at that. We've done a room. Hey, that wasn't too hard. Good boy. You helped. You helped. You did a very good job. Well done. Into the living room. Hello, fella. You haven't moved. Good boy. Good boy. There was some stuff on the table. It's just a remote now. As you can see, this collection of hair. It, like it does really. It does really need clean. I've also been told the house smells like wet dogs. Now I'm gonna presume it's something to do with you. I can't really smell it because obviously I live here all the time, I just, I don't smell it, I haven't got a very good sense of smell anyways. We'll give you a brush though before we hoover so that you're not spreading hairs around and then maybe we'll have to give you a bath once it's all done. So in here there's some stuff gone from there, there's some there, you know I still have a lot and there's like a load in the loft which we'll show you because I need to go up there anyways. Now this, now this is amazing, this is from Smooch and Pooch, I think. This is amazing, we never actually found a home for it as well, this became a home, but you see it's still got the wrap on it. It's still got this, like... However, I'm gonna have to get, I'm gonna have to move it and put it in the loft to just... Look, Winston's on it, and this whole wall here is full of pictures of Winston. Now everyone's different, but the thing is, I just don't want reminded that I had three dogs. I don't want reminded about Winston every single day. It's because it's just, it's hard not having him around, and... I, ju I just don't need that reminder, okay? 
So we'll take the photos of Winston down, we'll put them in like a memory box or something, and we'll just have photos of Stan and Stan and Pabs. Apologies, I've been pretty good about it until now, but saying out loud, it's just a little bit different. Anyways, this ear is now completely blank. Well, I say completely blank, obviously we've got some things, but that was completely full, so we need to maybe rearrange that, put something else in there, get something else for that. Uh, we can probably do with some more cushions, because that one's knackered. We've already got rid of one of them. And it's just looking a bit, and just a little bit bare bones. It needs something else to it. There were blankets on it, but to be honest, we don't really sit on there anymore. We just spend time upstairs in the office and the bed. We watch all our movies upstairs in the bed, don't we? Yeah. But all of this costs money. How much of it do we have, Stan? Yeah, not a lot. We need to we need to get rid of this thing. This thing's just a big lump doesn't do anything uh we've got an assortment of beds now and here this was from chelsea's car that she doesn't want so i might end up throwing that in my car the throw i don't that used to be on there the box of toys again we've got winston's name on it so maybe i have to get a different box i mean it's all chewed up anyways but all them toys haven't moved for the past like three days i only took them out because they do like chewing them so i thought i'll take them out leave them out and see if any toys make their way out of the box and nothing has. So clearly Winston was just the one who was always playing with the toys and dragging everything out. So, so far. Used to. Haven't used any toys. So we can definitely cut that down and get a little smaller box and just have one or two, just in case they do decide one day you want to have a little play. What? What are you saying? This big bear was just to go out to charity shop or just whatever, but Stan, Stan's been dragging it around, so he quite likes it, so I, I don't really want to keep it, but we'll see. So yeah, we need something to replace that. I might get in touch with Smooch and Pooch again and see if they'll do one with just Pablo and Stanley, but like, I thought, yeah, take that away. And like this sort of thing here, I just did. Boom. There, done. That looks okay. But then obviously I've got nothing there. So I need to get something like that. We'll leave it there for now. The only other thing, this here, this blanket I got, Christmas blanket, it is from TK Maxx, or depending on where you are in the world, TJ Maxx. Um, that's what it is. Paws of Distinction Holiday Collection. It's really nice. Bone and paw. Blanket. So I got that for Christmas. Christmas is coming around the corner soon. Just I know everybody will ask when I get that out where'd it come from. So that's where it is and if you know TK Maxx, TJ Maxx, you'll know for a fact it's something you can't probably end up buying. But there you go. Should we go upstairs? But yeah, I'm probably not going to sort the majority of this stuff yet. I'm just doing this video to show you guys what's going on in our lives because this is what we're on with. Uh, this here is changed, I've already sorted this out, I've pulled this from somewhere else and that from somewhere else, so the holes looking okay. Uh, my office isn't going to change any, it just is what it is, I've still got my GoPros and stuff to sell, but actually I bought some AirTag trackers, which I'm going to try and use on the boys' harnesses, so I'll do a video on them because I think they're going to be very good and very helpful. So I'll do a video on them, I'll see if there's any cop. Now, I did have shelving units here and some stuff on the wall there. I did start to kind of redecorate this room, but now that's kind of back-end priority. I need to... I think the other rooms are priority, I understand. So this room can just be kind of left as it is. That's obviously just leave that as a blank wall now. That's all fine. One room I didn't show. Hall! Oh, that's exactly the same. The downstairs bathroom now just my shoes on the shoe rack. It was absolutely full. The floor is now clear. It's a bit, bit of mud and stuff. Um, there was something on that windowsill. There was a little flower on there or something. So I just fill that up, put some on there. Upstairs, oh, I've been left this wonderful giraffe. There was some other stuff on here. I've also been left this. I need to clean up. Um, there's nothing left on there, so I might just put my shower stuff on there, I guess. Oh, I've got these 
Chelsea put these on the glass. I'm going to be honest, that's not a quote I use particularly often, so I'll try and get these off. Depending on how hard they are. The dressing room! Empty! There's just nothing. Absolutely nothing. There's more things written on there. There's more things written on there. Hello. It just is empty. Well, I mean, it's full of. This all needs to go out. Charity shops, sell, whatever. That all stuff needs to go. Obviously, this was filled with claws. Dressing table. I don't need this. These covers here. Absolutely nothing. There's a few boxes down there. These just all empty drawers. This, that, that, this, and that is now just useless. There's nothing in there. You're watching me. Are you watching me? My lens isn't wide enough to get everything in. Now, this is just all my stuff, and them units there has got all my stuff in. I could probably condense it all down into two. Like that, that's just a filing cabinet that can just go in the loft. The, all the dog stuff could just go in like a little set of drawers. That's just the clothes. So I can put all the clothes that are in there, probably in there. And then the stuff in the drawers can probably go in there. Now I'm gonna have a full like overhaul in here anyways of clothes and stuff, because basically all the stuff I wear is so old and knackered now. Speaking of clothes though, one thing I didn't mention in the last video was merch. Now the merch that we use for our merch, I've took all the merch down for now because basically they're using like new distributors and all the clothing is now different. So it's like the t-shirts, the hoodies, everything is now different. Now until I've physically got one and see what it's like quality wise, I obviously don't want them just to change and maybe be unaware of you guys getting stuff that I haven't like seen or tried. So I'm gonna... Sorry, got an itch. I've got some ideas for some like newish merch, so what I'll do is I'll fire them through, I'll buy some samples, and if I think they're good enough, I'll then release them to you. But that's, I forgot to mention that in the last video, but yeah, merch is gone for now, and until I figure out if it's any good, we'll then put it back on. Right. Ooh. I might use them, I might use them. Bedroom. Um, I took the throw off that was on here originally, I put this one on, but this one is... Kind of... Awful. It's just a blanket we've used for the dog, so it's a bit, it's a bit there. Yeah. I don't really know what's missing here. The, the crushed velvet lampshades, not to my taste, so maybe replace them. Up here on the walls, there's now nothing. This were all covered in like plants and stuff. So if you can tell, echo. There's a really nice echo in this room now, which it always was echoey, which is why I put these up and put stuff on them to like break the echo, but. Now there's nothing there. This unit in the corner, there is now nothing on there, except three little pop figures. Oh, look how dusty that is. Eesh. And then we've got this unit, which is completely empty. So what I might do is I might move some of the drawers from that room into here. So I've got like my underpants and socks near the bed. That would make sense. And the TV is sound bad, that's okay. This is the only thing, things I've got left. These plants, because this one's broken. Should go a lot like further down. This one's snapped. These ones are, are broken. So I've been left a nice little broken one. So I might find a place for these. The overall plan for upstairs though, I don't know yet. Because my thought wasn't here, if this is all the stuff I need, is all these wardrobes and these drawers here. And this is the master bedroom, so this is actually the bigger room, is that I could put the bed in here, put the TV against this wall here, and then have this as just a complete bedroom with everything I need. And so essentially, all that would go there, and this root, this bit here, would just basically be this replicated there. And then this would just become the spare room, I'd maybe just put them drawers in. The wardrobes, to be fair, need to actually go to the bin, you can see it's all like falling apart. When I first moved in, I did start with this room off as the bedroom, and then I moved it to there, because we needed more space, because Chelsea wanted like a dressing table and stuff, and that didn't fit in there as a room. But thinking about it, we've got the street light right there, so we need to put curtains on there because it does come through and it, this room is quite light on a night. Whereas this one is just straight into the back garden and it's covered by tree. There's no light coming through there, so it's nice and dark. Without curtains, I mean they are curtains, but they don't exactly block out light. I would move the wardrobes from here into here, but then I'm going to lose like all the TV and stuff and they don't fit down the sides because the bed, it's too, this room's too small. I was then debating maybe moving my office into here and put my office across there but it's just too big and I generally don't need anything more than just that there. That's fine. This room's fine. I'll leave this room just completely as it is. Now I did think about possibly turning like getting rid of this, getting rid of that and turn it into a home gym. 
<laughs> yeah, um, yeah, nope, I've never used a gym before, so that would probably be a waste of money. I mean, maybe I'd use it if it was physically in my house, but I don't know, it's going to probably cost a lot of money to get the equipment, and then I maybe just need to leave this room. Just, I don't know, if you guys have any suggestions of what I should do, please do leave them in the comments down below. Right, we've rambled on quite a bit, little man. It's a bit pathetic, but it'll do. Then what if we put the... I don't mind that, that's just a 100k YouTuber subscriber plaque. So that's all on that. Da? Damn it, I was gonna put that on there, but it's too like center heavy in the middle bit here. So it's just falling off because it's not wide enough to like tip it back. So I can get something, I get a little hook for it. Something to sit there, maybe. I don't know. You seen a bird? Does not like birds. Another thing in here though is this bed needs replaced because this um, headboard's absolutely broken. And anybody who smirked, I'd like, get your head out the gutter. So I ideally need to replace the bed frame. I also want to replace the duvet covers and things like the blankets, stuff like this. Because it all just, it's all stuff that like we bought together and I just want my own things now. I just kind of detach them memories from the house as such because everything in the house just reminds me of something. So I'm like, Ugh. Now I've thought for quite a while boys. So what we need to do now is we need to go get the cleaning stuff and clean out the house. Are you cleaning your brother? That's a good, that's a good egg. I think I rambled on quite enough about this, but obviously I just want to let you guys know so you guys are like kind of involved with all this and you just can help out. And if you think of any ideas, you can let me know. But I just want you involved. If I'm going to involve you in my life, you need to be involved in almost like every aspect of it rather than just the dogs because then you don't understand what's going on elsewhere, what we're doing. So if I just show you everything we're doing, then that works. And then once we're all cleaned up, I think we'll do a little supermarket trail because you need to get some dishwasher tablets and some other little bits and bobs. So we'll have a look, see if they've got any like furniture bits because especially in here, I didn't quite cover it, but this was absolutely covered. That was full of stuff. Obviously all that was covered. So this is all completely bare now. So if I'm going to leave this, I could be putting like something on top of it. I have got quite a few like spare photo frames in the loft, which I might go up and grab a few just to kind of fill some gaps and then we'll get the photos to put in them. I've also got loads of like toys, collectibles, whatever you want to call them that I could put places, but I kind of want to stay away from that as much as I can really. And I'll just try to put the cathemeric shield in the, in the living room, but that's, that's, that's acceptable. That's one, one thing and it's, it's cool. It's cool. It's cool. It's cool, right? It's cool. I actually have two. Not to lie. I have three. I have three. But stuff like that, like the Mando helmet, Iron Man helmet, I've got some other varied Ant Man, Black Panther, all stuff like that. I could put them places, but this is going to be the hardest thing to fill. I really don't. There was like books and plants and things that I don't have books. I can't read. So I, I can read. Like, I can read. I'm that. I can read. I can like, like I can. I can actually read. But if I read like a book with paper, this this is gonna sound stupid, but if I read a book, I feel sick. Explain that. I, there's, there's something to do with the smell of paper and then reading, it just, something goes on and I feel really sick. I can do about half a page and I feel sick. But it's not normal paper, it's that book paper. Book has, books have a different smell. Anyways, let's go get the hoover. I've got all the cleaning stuff, now I don't have the memory card capacity to go and film all and time lapse everything. So, I think we'll just skip until it's all clean. Like I said, the house is actually tidy, so it's going to be no different. It's just going to be me go around the cleaning stuff, so it's kind of cool when 
you know, there's loads of mess and it becomes really clean, but since it's already tidy, it's just cleaned in. It's not gonna really show anything up. So we'll jump back in in a couple of hours time, I imagine, maybe even longer. And then we'll go do some supermarket shopping and go see if we can find some bits for around the house. Yeah, so I guess three, two, one. We're done. It's all clean. It looks the same. It's all nice and cleaned up. Clean, clean, dusted, cleaned. Are you clean? Nope. Clean, 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 and clean. So everything is sparkling, done. We're almost out of daylight. So what we're actually going to do is we're going to go walk the boys. Do you want to go for a walk? We'll go for a walk. Yeah? So what we'll do is we'll walk these two, we'll get them back, we'll get them fed, and then we'll go, because we might be a little while. These, ugh, I can't get off. They're gonna to be too difficult to get off. So I'll leave them on for now. Same with that mirror there. I don't want that mirror, I don't really can see it like there. It's like an arc and there. That's where the two like screws are, and it's like warped the mirror. So it needs like a bar underneath, so I might just replace that. Oh my God, it's just, it's just pennies and it looks, yeah, it looks all right. I didn't show you in here. I've cleared like the loft and stuff out. So all of this stuff, all this stuff here, uh, that, not the towels. Just, I'm gonna just take it all to like the charity shop and just give it away as just games and stuff. But, so I need to get rid of that as well as all the soft toys that were in there. These, I know I said it's because of the echo, we put them up to stop the echo, but I might just take them down because just the amount of dust that collects up on there it's quite disgusting, so if I didn't have them there, there'd be no dust, and then nice and clean. Might be a bit of an echo, but... The only other thing, this here, my Black Panther, is velvet. Whether well, you can see, but it's all velvet. Now, to try and dust that and get it clean is a nightmare. If anybody's ever dealt with velvet stuff and cleaned it, please let me know in the comments what to do, because it's all, it looks okay at the moment. It took us about 20 minutes of just scrubbing it with a toothbrush to kind of like brush the dirt off. I don't know whether I need to clean it or something. So if anybody has any velvet cleaning tips of Black Panthers, let me know. I'm gonna go for a walk. Come on then. Since this video is already dragging enough, we might as well make an extra long video for you guys. If you are bothered. Now this is where the GoPro would be perfect and also when we go shopping, but I haven't set it up yet. So I'm gonna do that tonight. I've also got these two videos to edit tonight. Or two videos, there's one before and this, and this one. Oh, big yawn. Let's go then. Out on a walk, do 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 do. Out on a walk, do 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 do. Out on a walk, do 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 do. Out on a walk. Meow. Hiya. Go on, pubs. Oh, what's going on? If you're wondering why there was towels in here before, so when we get back from walks, we can dry you. Yay! What I might do is I might try and get that into a proper towel rack because that is the most, it's, that is the smallest, patheticest radiator you've ever seen. It's ridiculous and it's on a horrendous angle, so. Maybe get that turned into like a proper towel rail and then we can dry the towels as well in here. Cause that's getting dark, isn't it? Mm. So yeah, that's that's another thing we may do. We'll leave my light on, we'll leave my TV on, and we'll close this because it'll be dark by the time we get back. We don't want anybody seeing that you're home alone. I reckon they'll just sleep the whole time, so we'll get away, we'll go see what the shops have. We're hopefully they're open late to like eight o'clock tonight. It's midweek. So we're gonna go scouting around, see if we can find anything. And we'll catch back up at the end. Ah, yeah. First stop, Rangi. Soft. Mm. Chop one down. Um, I don't think this is going to go very well. Because I'm not spending £20 on a cushion. I don't have that kind of money just to flog around on cushions. Um, We'll try some other shops. Let's not get disheartened after one shop. Let's go. Stop two, do none. See, these are cool, but the cable comes right out the middle, so it's just gonna look messy. 
even like down the lake. They come up. Hmm. Now I'm a little disheartened. Now, I, how, how, what kind of bedding do you get if you don't want flowers and you don't want pinks and yellows and you just want like normal colour and you don't want like sequins on it? And there's nothing. There's absolutely nothing. I'm gonna keep trying, but I think this was a bit of a waste of time. But let's go number three. Number three, Satinsbury. <laughs> beep beep. Number four. Number four, next home E. I actually have to sell my soul to get something from there. Stupid prices. Drop the numbers and something button me. Last stop, ASDA. Let's do this. Hello boys, daddy's back. Hello. Hello. Oh, look at that little tail. Look at that little waggly tail. Hello, 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 hello. Are you? Sorry daddy was so long. And guess what? I didn't get anything. Anything at all. Didn't even get my dishwasher tablets. Nope. Nothing. Absolute waste of time. I just wanted to get a few little bits. It didn't really matter what. Just like a little ceramic elephant or just anything just to go somewhere in the house. I just wanted to spruce it up. Towels, benches, anything just to make the house somewhat less depressing than it already is. But got absolutely nothing. So yeah, I just can't be, can't be bothered. I'm going to just go sit in my office and edit these videos and just... It's hard enough as it is, but we're just gonna have to deal with it. It just is what it is. We'll wrap the video up here. I hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Peace out, guys.